Welcome back, folks, to the Organ Trail Director's Cut. And when last we left off, we were in St. Louis, and we're thinking of heading out on the road again. The supply situation is, quite frankly, excellent. We have large quantities of fuel and scrap and food. We could actually just go buy a muffler now I'm thinking about it. We can't because they don't have a muffler spare. Which is a pity, but hey. We have loads of everything. And this is a perfect time to head out and move on to another location. We're gonna go to Badger City, because then we could do a little shortcut through the uh, radioactive area. I think that's a good idea. We could go to the cave, but no, we're going to Badger City. However, you must cross a horde of zombies, but we have the chainsaw windows, so we're going to automatically fight through. There is no problem here. Chainsaw windows are amazing. Ah, <laughs> kept the horde at bay. Lovely. It's not far away to Badger City. Oh, you suddenly find yourself surrounded by zombies. Oh dear. Oh dear. This is bad. This is really bad. Uh. We do not want this at all to happen. I didn't know this was a thing that could happen. We just need to fight these zombies off. I'm sure we can fight them. Gotta be very careful. Fortunately, we can reload very quickly, which is going to prove to be very good. We don't want to uh, lose anyone. If you do actually fail, like, fording a horde of zombies, you can actually lose party members. People can just get dragged out of the car and killed. But fortunately, we survived the attack. That was, uh, not great. Let's have that never happen again. But it has a broken leg. Oh, Barnet. It's alright, you'll get better. You scare off a bandit siphoning your gas tank. Hmm, lost a little bit of fuel there, I'd think. Welcome to Badger City. It's okay, we're here now. Auto Shop has a upgrade. A radio. Chance to heal the party members. Well, if we've got nothing else to put there, why not? But what jobs are available first? I dropped something of great value to me just outside of town. Yeah, that one is a... the one that killed Sub-Zero. So let's be careful. Let us be careful. And not shoot anything if we don't have to. Carefully does it. Travelling diagonally is slower, so you do have to be careful about that. It's always faster to travel in a straight line. And not shoot anything behind you. We do have to go a little bit diagonal here, and we do need to shoot that one. One bullet, however, I can uh, gladly... Two bullets. I can gladly afford to use to get all these dollars. Excellent. You made it. We are not doing that one. I will not succeed. What do they have to sell? A lot of things. But we don't really need any of it. We don't really need any of it at all. What time of day is it? 3 a.m. Well, the first thing we're going to do is we're going to actually do some trading first. Seven of their scrap for... No. We might as well do a bit of trading. See if we can get some good stuff. One of their mufflers for one of your batteries. That is a really good deal. We needed a spare uh, muffler, and we had one extra battery. What else have we got? Two of their fuel for one of your medkits. Um, no. I'm going to say no there. One of your medkits for six of their scrap is an awful deal, but four of your fuel for one of their scrap, that is an even worse deal. That is a horrendous deal. Three of their scrap for one of your tires is also bad? One of their scrap for 24 of your dollars is horrendous. And lastly, 59 of your food for one of their batteries is great, and 5 of their scrap for one of your batteries is awful. And it is now medium scavenging. We are most certainly now going to buy that radio. Because, why not? Why not? 
car looks pretty decent so far, and it's very well repaired. We want to head out, however, of this place with full health. Because we are not going to go into the uh, area beyond, into the radiation field, without that. Also, we do want to buy another medkit. 30. It actually would have been worth it to trade one for uh, two, but the difference was so small. The difference was so small. We can buy a medkit after we scavenge. We can buy a medkit after we scavenge. We could take the shotgun with us. We could take the shotgun on that, uh... Hello, food! We could have took the shotgun in the attempt to get the, uh... Protect that place, but, uh... I'm not gonna even try that one. I suppose I'll grab it. There's really not much point. We have grabbed the, uh... Equivalent of a buffalo. And I suppose we'll grab that too. If only so that there is a chance that other things may spawn. Which they won't, but, uh... They might. Speaking of other things that might spawn, let's just go completely overkill on the uh, scavenging things front. Also, uh, we need to be careful. Uh oh! Don't take another shot, just run. Yeah, we, we got way too much food there. But activity is now low, so it's always worth scavenging. Hello, bullets! We have 450 bullets. That's a lot of bullets. We pretty much stayed consistent on our bullet count. But that's because this time I've been far more careful with them. Not shooting unless I really feel like I need to shoot. And avoiding zombies whenever I can. Speaking of, uh, things to grab, here's some more scrap. We might actually get something else, Spawn. But, no, oh, all the way over there. Not quite sure I can reach that anyway. I might actually reach it. Ah, oh, there's, uh... Nah, I'm not gonna reach it. I hit something! I don't know what I hit, but I hit something. Probably a zombie off-screen there. Pretty accurate. Ooh, more money. Money's always good to grab. But I'm not gonna run into that barbed wire there, because I don't know if that'll hurt me. I know running into the radiation pools hurts you. Definitely hurts you. There we go. A little bit more food. Bet the next thing's gonna spawn on the other side of the screen. No, it's right here. That's handy. I'll grab it. Excellent. Low zombie activity? Always the best time to scavenge. During the day. But the zombies aren't more aren't as active. Wonder why that is. Imagine that's a traditional, um, like movie zombie lore thing where the zombies are only active more at night. Not really my thing watching uh, zombie movies. Don't tend to watch them. More food. There we go. Ooh, I was about to walk into a zombie there, but hey, bullets and... Mm, you're going for that scrap. Oh dear. Oh, that was close. That was close. Did not want to die horribly there. Will, however, grab this. There we go. That was a close save there. Also, I want those bar- Hello! I want those barrels. We can't take the barrels with us? No? No, didn't think so. We are, however, going to, uh... Ooh, hello! Also, I know what kind of zombie you are. You're just dying off screen. You stopped moving when I looked at you. That says one thing to me. Whoa! Hello! That was a poor decision, sir. That is my massive pile of money. We are spending some money while we're here. I don't know what we're buying, but we're buying something. Because that is $120. And that is a ridiculous amount of money. Also, I tried to shoot that zombie that was eating the person, but I missed. A hundred and twenty dollars. And we have more time to scavenge before it gets to medium. We can get some more food. We don't even need this food right now. We might later. But we don't right now. And there's some more food. We'll just grab that as well. We can always sell it later. And there's some more food. We can always sell this later too. Alright, gotta be careful. Just, uh... Go this way around. Hello, more money! 
You're gonna run into that, aren't you? Yep, and I'm going to get that money. Ah, bad luck, sir. Bad luck. We got a maximum amount of food and 50 more dollars. We have a colossal amount of money. What do we want to buy? Well, we could buy some more med kits. Let's buy two. Do we need more fuel? The car doesn't need fixing up. We could do with buying a little more fuel. Why not? We'll buy five more fuel. There we go. We have a ridiculous amount of fuel. It's Eighteen and a half cans. I think we just need to do some resting now. And uh, get ready for the journey ahead here. We also need to use a medkit on Barnet to get him roughly to the same health we're at. Let's do some resting. Let's go fishing! Let's try and grab the one that's at the bottom there. Someone was, something was really intent there at uh, getting, uh, getting caught. It was that there. Very intent. Oh, looks like we got this. What is this? Let's find out. Oh, it's a fish. That's a plus. Excellent. One swordfish. Still a few things we haven't yet actually caught. A few hours of resting. But only one more hour of resting is really going to be needed. One more, because I want E.T. to be literally at maximum health here when we go out. Because uh, there's nothing more we actually need here. Have we done any trading? We did some trading, didn't we? There's nothing else we need. The car is in great condition. The party's in good condition. And uh, a massive amount of supplies. Let's, uh, oh, let's have one last look in town. There's nothing we want here. And there's nothing particularly we want there. Let's go. We are heading to uh, Wichita which has a uh, never break batteries. We could do that and then just head there. It's a nice shortcut. Let's go through the radiation. Ooh, different music for that. Different music. Now here comes all the uh, the radiation. <laughs> Gotta be careful. Fortunately, it's not that far. And nothing appears to be happening either. Nothing is happening. It's an entirely uneventful journey so far. I spoke too soon. Barney, why did you do that? We have spares, but why did you do that? Barnet, why did you do that? <laughs> is that just because we were holding the map upside down? The Count has typhoid. The Count will recover. I think we have arrived, and we need to spend as little time as we can here. That guy's doing pretty well. Doing very well there. They got a nice thing going there, just using the um, things there to shoot. Well done. What jobs do we have? There is a... Whoa! 192 ammo? <laughs> Think they mean to take over? Well, they're not going to take over while we're here. 192 ammo. 192 ammo? Pretty good. Well, there's one less of them to deal with. Two less of them to deal with. I wonder why they consider this extremely difficult. Is it because of the uh, sheer amount of things you have to keep your eyes on? I don't know, but now there's only a few of them left. 23. Oh, we need to aim a little higher. Like here. For his head. Just need to wait for a good opportunity. Like here. That's a little too high. We got time. There we go. Two to go. Don't shoot them with your laser eyes. Your laser eyes would just be too unfair. One to go. One to go. Sorry, sir. Oh. Just hit you while you were in cover. Not that time, though. We got a ridiculous amount of ammunition for that. Also, the auto shop has quite a nice special. Never break batteries. Batteries never need replacing. Bye. We have a fully upgraded car. Completely upgraded. There are five slots and there are five upgrades. Lovely. We do need to do some repairing. 
what's the... Uh, we don't actually want to do any repairing while we're here. That is something I've just realized. We don't want to do that. We Do we want to trade? Someone will trade... Um, yeah, good deal. And uh, one of their tires for six of your scrap? Also a good deal. Two of your... No. We are not trading. We're not staying here long. At all. In fact, how much would it cost to repair the car? Pay $16 to repair the station wagon? Yeah. Good deal. Do we want to sell anything while we're here? We could sell a bit of food and get a little bit of uh, money back. We sell 300 food. And then we sell, I don't know, 20 scrap. Actually, we sell more scrap than that. We have 236. Let's just sell like 50 scrap. We don't actually want to stay in the radiation area long, as I said. We want to leave very quickly. Besides, the uh, situation is not good for scavenging. So, if we got everything we wanted. We're not doing that job, because that job's ridiculous. We've got the upgrade. We don't need to buy anything. We're just leaving. Right away. Now, we could head even further to the old gas station. That gets us a fair distance along the road. We're going to do it. It's a long way away, but we're going to do it. Military vehicle pulls you over and questions you for an hour. We should be okay, though. We should be okay. We just need to travel quickly along the road, and then the fog happened. The fog happened. Fortunately, we have a lot of medkits. And we're just getting lost everywhere. This is the dangerous part. This is the very much... Oh, wow, the count is not doing well. The count is not doing well. I don't know what happens if that overtakes that. The Count no longer has Typhoid. That at least is good. You see a tombstone? Yeah, let's have a look. Grave of some unknown hacker. 34 ammo! Can't complain. We do need to use some medkits when we get to the next location. But this is getting radiation sickness. Oh, well, that's severe radiation sickness there from E.T. Barney gets shot by a stray bullet. Oh, no. We need to get out of here fast. Barney breaks a... Oh, Barney's incapacitated. That is really bad. What jobs do we have? $24 and 6 scrap. The first thing we need to do... Barney is incapacitated. You'll see him there. We need to use a medkit on him to bring him back. Administer the medkit carefully. Uh. That work? Close enough. Barney recovered 26 health. It's not bad. This is why we have medkits. Oh, you have to use... Oh! When they're incapacitated... It also cures some radiation sickness, too. While they're incapacitated, you uh, have to... Uh, you have to apply it like that. It did work, though. No one to trade with. What do you have to buy? There's a lot to buy. We do want some spare medkits. Combat trainer. Money scavenger. Hmm. Yes. That's a risk, because we don't now have much money, but uh, there's something hidden at the back of the graveyard. We'll do it. $24? Seems good. We're going to take the shotgun with us this time. The shotgun has a spread fire. We might need spread fire. Also, no zombies. Oh, there are the zombies. We're going to go back the way we came. Yeah, you see that? Two shots there, one... Two kills there, one shot. Much better. Now, we're just going to leave because all the zombies spawned on the other side. I'll take it. Not doing that one for six scrap. No, not doing it. There are jobs... There is a combat trainer we just used. We could buy some more medkits. We could sell some more food. This is basically what we were holding all this food for and all the scraps so that we could sell things and we can get more supplies. 300 food is fine and we will sell another 40 scrap. We're pretty healthy on the scrap situation. We need some more medkits. We definitely need more medkits. They have 11 in stock. We'll buy th Ooh. We'll buy two. No, we'll buy three. 
We'll buy three. We have plenty, plenty of money. And the supply situation is still healthy. It's just the party is, uh, not so healthy. We actually want to use a mech kit on ET here. Reduce that radiation sickness. Definitely want to reduce that radiation sickness there. But we have traveled a fair amount of distance. I mean, we've made some good headway there, just cutting over this radiation. Definitely some huge headway. And so, when we come back, folks, we'll continue along the road. Hopefully get out of the radiation and uh, not come back, because the radiation is dangerous. So I'll catch you next time, folks. And I'll see you then. Later.